क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव एक्स क्यूब प्लस एक्स प्लस टेन डिवाइड बाई एक्स प्लस टू ना वेन यू लुक एट दिस वन यू कैन सी एक्स क्यूब देर देर इज नो थ्री एंड देर इज वन इन बिटवीन नो टू देन वील फिक्स दिस सम एक्स क्यूब प्लस थ्री जीरो एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस एक्स वन प्लस टेन थ्री टू वन जीरो नाउ इट्स फाइन एक्स प्लस टू नाउ इन स्टार्ट इट्स गोइंग टू बी द सेम एक्स क्यूब डिवाइड बाय एक्स एक्स स्क्वायर एक्स स्क्वायर टाइम्स एक्स एक्स क्यूब एंड दिस इज गोइंग टू बी टू एक्स स्क्वायर टू टाइम्स एक्स स्क्वायर टू एक्स स्क्वायर so you have to minus then this is minus 2x square bring 1 down now you have 2 so then this is going to be um how many x goes into minus 2x square or oh, minus 2x square divided by x which is minus 2x so this is minus 2x then uh, this is going to be minus 2x square when you multiply by it, this is going to be Uh, minus 4x. When you minus, this is become 5x plus 10. And then x 5x divided by x, this is going to be 5. 5 times x 5x. 5 times 2 plus 10, this is going to be 0. So the answer is x cube plus x plus 10 equal x plus 2 times x square minus 2x plus 5 this is also the same issue here 3 2 is missing we will fix the issue 2x cube plus 0x square minus 17x plus 3 3 2 1 and constant So x plus three. How many x goes to two x cube? Two x square. Two x square. This is two x cube, and this is two times three, six x square. Then you want to minus. So this is going to be minus six x square. Bring this one down minus seventeen x. So answer is minus six x square. Now we need to go further. Bring this one down, and there should be one more line to reduce. So this is going to be minus six uh, x minus six x square divided by x. How many x goes? Into minus six x square minus six x. This is minus six x square uh, minus eighteen x. So this is going to be x n plus three. So then when you clearly look at, you can see x plus three and x plus three. Then only matching is plus one. You don't need to think about. So then, it is going to be x plus three and zero. So two x square uh, minus seventeen x plus three equal x plus three equal two x square minus six x plus one. This is part A. See, now there is an issue. We have to fix this one first. You know what it is now. This is plus fifty x. There is no x square, so I will write zero x square plus fifty x. Then uh, minus eight. Now it's fine. I put this x square into the middle. Minus three x cube zero x square plus fifty x. Right, x minus four. Now this is going to be minus three x cube divided by x, which is going to be 
minus 3x square so this is minus 3x square and minus 3x square times x minus 3x cube this is 3 times 2 12 and minus times minus plus x square then we have to minus this one which is become minus 2 x square bring this one down 50x now because we need to get now 12 minus 12 x square divided by x mean minus 12 x so this is going to be uh, minus 12 x so minus 12 x times x minus 12 x square this is going to be 44 plus uh, x so this is going to be 6 x minus and minus 8 uh, 4 times 2 times 4 is 8 this is 48 actually then this is going to be 50 minus this is 2x because I check it doesn't uh, going to be like cancel out so I thought I made a mistake and I double check then I saw this one and then uh, yes now this is going to be plus 2 and uh, 2 times x uh, 2x this is going to be minus 8 when you minus it is going to be 0 you can write the answer minus 3x cube plus 50x minus 8 equal x minus 4 you don't need to write 0 x square here because uh, it is a trick or the, we introduce uh, to simplify this sum and minus 3x square minus 12x plus 2 question number 6 this is when I look at this one part a 3 2 power 1 is missing I'll delete this one and I write like keeping a distance and I will put 6 0 x1 which is 0 x x terms is there now 3 2 1 constant now it's fine so this is going to be x cube divided by x x square then this is going to be x cube minus 3x square then minus this is going to be 4x square then uh, uh, plus bring this one down 0x and then how many 4x square goes to x how many x goes to 4x square 4x square divided by x which is 4x this is going to be 4x then uh, 4x times 4x, 4x square, then 4 times 3, 12, and this is going to be minus and x, see now this is x, this is 0x, this is minus 12x, when you minus those two, this is going to be 12x, 0 minus minus 12, 0 plus 12, right? and uh, minus 36, and this is going to be plus 12 12x divided by x plus 12 so this is 12x and 36 when you minus this is 0 done x cube plus x square minus 36 i'm not going to write 0 now uh, x minus 3 times x square plus 4x plus 12 why i introduce for to get the help of simplification uh, other than that uh, everything is normal now this is part b when i read the sum i saw that the x part is missing then i didn't waste the time when i write the sum i already introduced that you can do when you read the sum you realize x is missing just introduce on the first time then we will start dividing so this is going to be 
2x cubed divided by x 2x square which is going to be then uh, 2x cubed plus uh, 2 times 5 10 x square then you have to minus it and when you minus this is going to be minus x square plus 0 x bring, bring whatever it is is there then this is going to be minus x this is going to be minus x square plus 5x minus it this is going to be minus 5x plus 25 minus 5x then to the next step we have to bring this plus 25 down then this is going to be minus 5 and minus 5x minus uh, something wrong look like because minus times plus minus then this is going to be add this has to be plus what is the error here erase this mm. x times y x y x minus times plus minus then minus minus become plus then 5x divided by x plus 5 then this is 5x plus 25 so answer is 0 when you get so you can write 2x cube 9x square plus 25 equal x plus 5 2x square minus x plus 5. So now you can see that I already introduced this one 3 to 1 is going to work. Now this is going to be minus 3x square minus 3x cube and this is minus times minus plus 6x square. This is going to be 11 minus 6 5 uh, x square bring this one down 0x and then this is going to be 5x and this is going to be 5x square minus 2x this is going to be 2x when you minus this 2 and minus 2 then uh, sorry 5, 5 times 2 not 2 it is 10 then this is going to be 10x and uh, then the this is going to be 10 10 times x 10 x minus 20 we have to minus 0 minus 3x plus 5x plus 10 now answer is minus 3x cube plus 11 square minus 20 you can write x minus 2 times minus 6x square plus 5x plus 10 Uh, question number 7 x cube plus 2 x square minus 5 x minus 10 equal you want to show this one so one method is we can take the right hand side and then we can simplify and tell this is equal to left hand side or you can show that x cube 2 x square minus 5 x minus 10 when you divide by x plus 2, your answer is going to be x square um, plus 5 plus or minus, minus 5. This is so x square minus 5. Or you can show this one x cube plus 2x square minus 5x minus 10 divided by x square minus 5 then your answer has to be x plus 2 you can uh, come to any approach but this one is the easiest one you know how to divide now and show this one but uh, i will stay with this one so right hand side right hand side equal x plus 2 times x square minus 5 we will expand this one 
x times x square minus 5 and plus 2 times x square minus 5. So this is x cube by x square 5x plus 2x square minus 10. Then x cube, what is uh, this term? 2x square, 3, 2, 1. Next one is 5x. And the last thing, what you take, which is left hand side. For your knowledge, uh, I will show you how to divide x cube plus 2x square minus 5x minus 10 divide by x square minus 5. So how many x cube x square goes to x cube that is uh, x s cube x square so x so x times x x cube x times 5 minus 5x and okay any zero any x square no then you can write zero x square or you can leave as it is. Uh, now the normal method. Only what I did he said differently. When you multiply by x, I don't write here. I write. I wrote in the relevant place, relevant column. Right? X linear, not the quadratic. Right? So now we we'll minus this one now from here and from here. So x cube plus 2x square minus 5x minus x cube minus uh, 5x. So x cube plus 2x square minus 5x minus x cube plus 5x minus x cube. This is cancel out. This is cancel out. Remaining is 2x square. And this is going to be 0. Or you can put this is 0 x square then simply minus this one you can see that this is going to be a 2 x square 2 minus 0 and this is cancel out minus minus cancel out so this is 0 x and then minus 10 I bring this one then how many x, x square goes to 2 x square 2 x square divided by x square 2 so this is going to be plus 2 then plus 2 times x square, 2x square, then 2 times 5 minus 10, minus those 2, this is cancel out, this is 0x and this is cancel out, 0x, so x cube plus 2x square minus 5x minus 10, divide x minus y equal, x plus 2 hence you cross multiply hence you can say that now question number 8 we have to find the reminder of this one uh, 7 divided by 2 is uh, 3 times 3 3 times 2 6 7 uh, minus 6 is 1 so the remainder so remainder is 1. So likewise, we'll work out the remainder. So we can write this one. 7 mean 7 divided by 2 equal 3 plus 1 remainder out of 2. Or you can we can write by crossing multiply by 7 multiply by 2 both side 7 equal 3 times 2 3 times 2 plus this is cancel out like this 7 mean 3 times 2 plus 1 now we'll divide this one 3 2 1 say constant that's fine so this is going to be x square and this is going to be uh, x cube plus uh, 5x square uh, and now we have to minus this one this is going to be minus x square minus 3x bring down for the next step 
and uh, this is going to be minus x and this is going to be minus x square plus 5x which is going to be my cancel out and minus 8x plus 2 uh, So this is a minus times plus minus. So this is going to be plus 2x. Because minus 3 minus minus 5 minus 3 plus 5 plus 2. Then uh, still we have to continue. How many x goes 2x goes 2x? x 1. Sorry 2. 2 times x, 2x, and 2 times 5, this is going to be 10. And when you minus those 2, 2 minus 10 minus 8. So now what is the remainder? Remainder is minus 8. So you can write like this x cube plus 4x square minus 3x plus 2. When you divide by x plus 2, you uh, uh, this is, you already know this is going to be uh, caution q u o t i n t and this x plus 5 usually called divisor and uh, divide by x plus and uh, minus plus uh, minus 8 so this is the remainder so this is uh, dy this one so this is the divisor caution and remainder so those are the terms uh, we can express this one in this way as well. It has to be remained minus 8, then out of x plus 5. Remained minus 8 out of x plus 5. When you multiply everything by x plus 5, we can write x cube plus 4x square minus 3x plus 2 plus 2 equal x plus 5 times x square minus x plus 2 uh, plus minus 8 or you can simply write minus 8 when you like write this this is and you are done. This is the divisor and the quotient and the remainder. So this is the divisor, this is in the quotient, and this is going to be the remainder. And part B. So this is going to be 3x cubed divided by x. This is going to be 3x square. Then this is going to be 3x cubed. 3 times 6, uh, 18 minus 18x square. So this is going to be minus and uh, this is cancel out. This is going to be minus 2x square and uh, this is 10x. Now this is minus 2x square divided by x minus 2x then minus 2x square plus 12x then when you minus those two you will get minus 2x plus this one down 5 and uh, this is going to be minus 2x going to be minus 2 then minus 2x plus 12 and when you minus 
it's going to be minus 7. It means when you 3x cube 20x square plus 10x plus 5 mean uh, you will get the divisor is x minus 6 and quotient is 3x square minus 2x minus 2 and the remainder is minus 7. Divisor, quotient and remainder. Minus 2x cubed divided by x, it's going to be minus 2x square. Then minus 2x square times minus 2x cubed. Then 2 times 4, 8. This is going to be plus 8x square. When you minus this one, it's going to be minus 5x square. And I'll bring this one down for the continuation. And then minus 5 square divided by x minus 5x then 5x times minus 5x square 5 times 4 20 minus times plus or 20x this is going to be minus 8 and bring then the 20 down and minus 8x divided by x is going to be minus 8 so minus 8x uh, plus 32 it's going to be minus 12 when you Minus, so you can write minus 2x cubed plus 3x square plus 12x plus 20 and divisor is going to be x minus 4 and quotient is going to be minus 2x square minus 5x minus 8 and the remainder is minus 12. Uh, this is going to be x square question number 9 and 3x square 3x cubed divided by x 3x square so this is going to be 3x cubed minus 3x square and when you minus those two this is going to be x square plus 4 and then when you multiply by plus x x square minus You can write like this and x minus 1 divisor. This is the quotient and uh, this is the remainder. So this is going to be question number 10. Uh, 3x4 divided by x, 3x cubed. So 3x4 and this is going to be 3 times 1, 3 and x cubed is going to be plus so this is going to be minus 11 x cube and plus 10 x square now minus 11 x cube divided by x it is going to be minus 11 x square then this is multiplied by that 11 x cube this is going to be minus 11 x square this is going to be when you minus 21 x square and bring this one down minus 3x then 21 x square divided by x this is going to be plus 21 x then plus 21 x square plus uh, 21 x when you multiply so when you minus you will get uh, minus 20 4x and bring this one down minus 25 and uh, again minus 24x divided by x minus 24 then minus 24x minus 24 this is when you minus this is become 1 so 2x plus 8x cube plus 10x square minus 3x minus 25 equal divisor x plus 1 and quotient is 3x cubed 11x square plus 21x minus 24 and plus remainder is 1. 
division, caution and remainder. Question number 11. Uh, we want to show that x plus 4 is a, a factor of this one. First of all, uh, is 2 a factor of 6? Is 2 a factor of 6? Yes, because, yes, because when 6 divided by 2, answer is 3 and no remainder, no remainder, is 2 is a factor of 7? No, because when 7 divided by 2, answer is 3 plus the remainder is 1. There are remainder. There is a remainder. There is a remainder. So if we want to show that, something is a factor of a polynomial then when you divide like 6 divided by 2 you will get a good answer without remainder so same thing we need to do if x plus 4 is a factor of this one if we want to show that we want to divide those two and we want to show that remainder is what zero so then it is a factor. So we'll work out. Now we have to divide again. When I check this is 3 and there is no 2. Then I have to write plus 0 x square. Uh, then uh, minus 73 x plus 28. Now x plus 4. Phi x cube divided by x, phi x uh, square. Then phi x square times x phi x cube. And this is going to be phi times 4, 20 x square. Then you want to minus this one. This will become minus 2 x square. And bring this one minus 70 through x. Then minus 20 x square divided by x. This is going to be minus 20 x then this is going to be minus 20 x square plus 80 20 times 4 80 minus times plus actually minus uh, 80 x and when you minus from here you will get plus 7 x plus 28 then 7x divided by x, which is plus 7. Then plus 7 times 7x, 28. Remainder is 0. Then you can write the remainder is 0. Hence, x plus 4 is a is a factor of y x cube minus 73 x plus 28 uh, 3 x cube divided by x this is 3 x square then 3 x square 3 x cube minus 3 times 2 6 x square this is going to be 6 x square minus 8x then uh, this is going to be 6x square divided by x this is going to be plus 6x and this is going to be 6x square 6 times 2 
12 minus minus 12x 6x square minus 12x and you know how to minus this is going to be plus 4x and bring this one down minus 8 and 4x divided by x is plus 4 so 4 times x 4x minus 8 which is 0 so you can write 3x cubed plus minus 8x minus 8 equal divisor x minus 2 and the quotient 3 x square plus e x plus 4 and no remainder uh, no remainder or remainder is 0 remainder is 0 hence x minus 2 is a factor of I'll take this is fx fx x cubed 0 x cubed plus 0 x minus 1 you want to divide by x minus 1 uh, x cubed divide by x is x square so x square times x, x cubed and this is going to be minus x square and when you minus this one you will get x square bring this one down 0 x then x square divided by x is uh, x then this is going to be x square minus x then this is going to be x again uh, x minus 1 when you minus this one and when you bring the this one down x minus 1 then we know x minus 1 divided by x minus 1 is plus 1 in other way so x cube minus 1 equal x minus 1 x square plus x plus 1 if you see in an algebraic calculation if this one x cube minus 1 and if you can remember this one you can directly apply this one for example you want to divide x cube minus by x minus 1 and you know that what x cube minus 1 mean x minus 1 x square plus x plus 1 and divide by x minus 1 this is cancel out answer is x square plus x plus 1 x plus 4 0 x cube 0 x square 0 x minus 16 so we divide by x plus 2 x 4 divided by x this is x cube then x cube times x this is going to be x 4 plus 2 x cube when you minus this one you will get minus 2 x cube and bring this one 0 x square then this is going to be minus 2 x cubed divided by x this is going to be minus 2 x uh, square minus 2 x square so minus 2 x square minus 2 x cube then this is minus 2 x square when you minus this one this is going to be positive 2x square and bring this one down 0x then this is going to be plus 2x then this is plus 2x uh, I think there is an error here 2x 2x square 2 times 2 4 then this is going to be this is going to be 4x square and bring this one down 0 0x zero then this is going to be plus 4x then 4x square plus 8x and you want to minus those two this is going to be minus 8x uh, minus 16 then this is going to be minus 8 minus 8 x minus 16 which is 0 then you can write the answer this one equal uh, x plus 2 times 
divisor x square plus 2x square plus 4x minus 8. Question number 15. I need to divide fx by pi x plus 4. And I want to show that there is a remainder. What is fx? fx mean uh, 10x cube plus 43x square minus 2x minus 10 divided by 5x plus 4. So 10x cube 5 10 divided by 2 x cube divided by x x square then 2x square 10x cube this is going to be 2 times 8 8 x square so you have to minus this one this is cancel out and this is going to be 35 x square bring this one down minus 2 x 35 divided by 5 7 and x square divided by x then this is going to be 7 times 5x 35x square uh, 7 times 4 28 plus 28x and we want to minus this one this is minus 30x then minus bring down minus 10 then this has to be minus uh, minus 30 divided by 5 minus 6 so, and x divided by x is 1 then minus 6 this is 30x this is minus 24 then this is going to be plus 14 the remainder is 14 you can write um, 10x cube plus 43x square minus 10, 10 equal divisor is by x plus 4 uh, by x plus 4 times quotient is 2x square plus 7x minus 7x minus 6 and uh, remainder is 14 this is also fx you can write instead of this one simply fx equal fx equal this one